like to have a website containing Flash and widgets without having to hire an expensive team of designers? Well, thanks to the Wix online application, you can do all of this on your own. In a phone interview with Wix co-CEO, Alon Block, he explains how their product works. What we developed essentially is an editor, a drag and drop editor that allows people to drag and drop any, any object that they want online or from their own media assets, whether it's a video, a photo uh, from Flickr, a video from, say, YouTube, uh, any text, any animation, any graphic, and throw it on and create a site in Flash that looks good, and you don't need to code. You don't need to go under the hood and understand the whole wiring and coding of the site. And as you can see, Wix gives users several options. It allows you to create a site from scratch, or it gives you samples to go by if you prefer that method. Users can design their own web content, which includes audio, video, animation, images, music, and text. This content can be published as standalone websites, or embedded as widgets into social networks, or as blogs. Content from YouTube and Flickr can also be imported for use on your site. And before you completely write this application off in fear that search engines will not crawl this site, listen to this. Wix creates an HTML container around each of their Flash-based websites. This container pulls all the text that's in the site out so that the search engines can crawl it and rank the site just as they would a regular HTML site. And if you're intrigued by the Wix application but still feel confused on how to implement it, watch as Alon walks me through the process. Using Wix, if, if I had a small business, where would I begin at creating a website? Say you're you're um, a, a small hotel, and um, you know so you you can go to Wix and see a sample that looks like that's relevant for a hotel, and just go in there, um, delete, edit, change whatever you don't want to do, make it your own, upload upload content you know from online or from from your own kind of computer, and then just press publish. So. Um, you can spend a few minutes or a few hours, depends on how creative you want to be. And you know, and, and some people, you know, some people feel it's it's too daunting to create a website because you know they've never done that before, so they they're more comfortable creating a sample. Other people kind of prefer to start with scratch from scratch because again, they don't need to code, so it's easy enough. If people are creatively minded, you know, they can do that. And Wix is currently available in public beta and is free of charge. To find out more about this application, visit its website at wix.com. Reporting for Small Business News, I'm Abby Johnson.